Hello, good morning, and welcome to another video tutorial in the series that I've been doing on the Phantom Ecosystem. In this video, our focus is going to be on what to do with those BEATS tokens that you're either getting from the XLQDR pool when you're getting your payout and you're receiving BEATS. Maybe you aren't clear what to do with those, and I'm going to show you what I'm doing with my BEATS tokens. Now, this video makes some assumptions. It assumes that you have the MetaMask wallet. It assumes that you have some FTM Phantom in that MetaMask wallet to pay for your transactions and to pair with your BEATS and it assumes that you have some beats in the wallet. So we're not going to be doing the harvesting step. We're literally going to go right into how we would stake and farm here on the Beethoven X website. And again, to get here, it's just beats.fi. And before we start doing any transactions, let me note again that all the information provided in this video tutorial is provided on an as is and as available basis. And you agree that your use of such information is entirely at your own risk. You should not construe any such information or other material in my video tutorial as legal tax, investment, financial, or other advice. Nothing in this video or on my YouTube channel constitutes a solicitation, recommendation, endorsement, or offer by myself or any other third party. I'm not liable for the loss of any fiat assets, tokens, or fees you incur as a result of you following the steps presented here. And this is not an investment uh, this is not investment advice and I am not an investment advisor. The opinions expressed in this video tutorial are for general information and entertainment purposes only and are not intended to provide specific financial and or tax advice or recommendation for any individual or specific product cryptocurrency token or investment product. All right. So now that we've got that out of the way and let's say that you either uh, have some beats in your MetaMask wallet or you've just harvested from the XLQDR vault and you want to put those beats to work for you. Well, here's exactly what you would need to do in order to make that happen. And you'll notice that if you look around on the farms that exist here on the liquid driver site there are no pairings for beats even when you come down here to beethoven you can see that we don't have any ftm to beats pairings the same is true over on the spirit swap site if we come to the farms you'll see that we don't have anything related to beats uh, we look at the boosted farms it's the same thing there are no pairings here for beats now you could swap your beats if you wanted to. You could certainly do that and swap them on Spirit Swap right here on the exchange. And you could turn them into something else if you wanted to leverage them that way. And you can see here if I was to click on FTM, there's beats, right? So I've got 30 beats and this is what we're going to be using today. But we're not going to swap them, right? I don't want to change them out for something else. I want to leverage the beats here on the Beethoven website. And we're gonna get paid out in what's referred to as F beats. And you'll see that here in a second. And the F just simply stands for fresh. So you're gonna be getting paid out in F beats, fresh beats tokens when we stake. So this is how easy it is. One of the things I love about the beats.fi site and the Beethoven site here is that they make it extremely simple for you to stake and farm once you have your liquidity pair. And again, that liquidity pair or the LP tokens that we're gonna be creating is when we take an equal amount of beats and FTM phantom, and we think of it as like, you know, you're, you're fusing them together to create this new thing called a liquidity provider token or LP token. So if I click on stake, and this is gonna bring us over here, and you can see I've already run through some test stuff and through um, a few dollars in here, not a lot, but take a look at the APR right now when you're staking your beats. So again, you could swap them, make them FTM and do something else. However, this is a pretty attractive option right here. So how do we do this? You can see I've got 0.0107 beats or a penny here. And so we're not going to harvest that up, but we're going to go ahead and invest. So what we're going to be doing is taking our beats, and this is sort of like step one, step two, step three, and they guide you all along the way here. In fact, there's even going to be a message you see pop up around the top area here. When we complete the first step, what we're getting are these, I think it's BPT, if I'm not mistaken, BPT, yeah, BPT, Fidel, uh, Fidelio Duetto BPTs. 
And then that is what we're going to be staking. And ultimately, we end up doing that stake to get F beats and then stake the F beats into the F beats farm. Again, it's all laid out right here. So let's dive in. So I'm going to click on invest. And I always use whatever I have less of here at the top. So you can see they, they want you to use FTM because it's a 2080 split. Now, if you're interested in the economics behind this and why that is, uh, back on the main page here, if you click on the three little dots, you go to Docs and Help, it's gonna open this page up here and it explains the 80-20 incentivized pools and how it helps to protect you from impermanent loss, right? So you could take a look here and get a lot of information about the Beethoven project and the Beats token. So let's work our way back over here. We're gonna click on Invest. Now, I can't put the Beats at the top. You'll notice it's either Wrapped FTM or FTM. And so we'll stick with the FTM. And what I'll do is I'll click on the max for the beats and then it'll match up here with FTM, but 20%. Remember, I was talking about the liquidity provider or LP tokens, how it's like a 50-50. Here, it's an 80-20. So 80% 80 of the liquidity provider token is going to be made up of beats. The other 20% is going to be FTM. So we'll click preview. I'm gonna go ahead and click invest. And again, remember, this is sort of step one of many steps. So it's 0 0.08, that's gonna be about 18 cents with the current price of FTM Phantom. So that'll be, let's say 20 cents, we'll round it up to 20 cents. And down here in the lower left, you can see it's saying invest pending. And so it's gonna wait here. And I did have one of these fail the other day, uh, but again, I reran it. So now you get investment confirmed. So we've taken 80%, or we'll take 100% of our beats, which makes up 80% of the liquidity provider LP token, and then we match that with 20% in FTM. So now that's given me this Fidelio Duetto BPT. Now you'll notice that this, these, uh, the you know, fireworks that are going off here, um, if you click finished investing, it'll stop. Now, this is the message I was exp uh, talking about earlier. And this is what I like, right? Because you might think, oh, okay, I'm done. Well, no, you've got unstaked BPT in your wallet. If you stake your BT BPT, you're going to receive fresh beats and be eligible to earn a portion of Beethoven X protocol revenue. So let's roll down here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it's very light and gray, right? But you can see it shows my balance of the uh, BPT uh, Fidelia Duetto tokens that are down here. So what I'd want to do is click max because again, this is step two. So step one is take the beats and create the LP token. Step two is to take these LP tokens, which are the BPTs and receive F beats. So let's mint F beats. So it's going to say confirm and it's 0.03, which is probably around 12 to 15 cents in phantom right now and so we're going to wait for this to be approved and you can see right there deposit confirmed great response time and so now we come down to step number three so we've invested the beats we got the bpts we invested uh, those staked them and now we have the fresh beats so now we're going to stake our fresh beats into the fresh beats farm so i'm going to click on max i'm going to click on deposit my f beats so we're probably 35 cents in. And again, that's going to be probably 17 to 19 cents right there. So again, not even a dollar to sort of make all of this happen here. And investment confirmed. And you can see how quick the response time was. Uh, it was super accurate. So we've got to wait a second. And there it is. So it has just updated. And it's showing you what your stake is. So I've got 33.1334 F beats. I could harvest, but again, it's a penny, so it's not going to be worth it because you're going to be end up paying more uh, in fees to, to harvest the penny. It's not simply isn't worth it. And again, I think I only had like five dollars in here before I sort of, you know, added to the stake. And so at this point, my beats are now being put to work for me at 140.96% right now. And you can see it gives you the sort of the breakdown as to how that pool uh, is divided up in terms of how you're earning the 140%. There's swap fees, there's FBeats APR, and there's also farm APR. And so now 
You sit back, you can earn passive income on your beats that are paired up. And the other thing I like about this sort of a closing comment is, let's say that you wanna withdraw. They make it extremely simple to withdraw. You come here and here are the steps in order to withdraw. And then ultimately, these things would end up back in your wallet or you could swap them out for something else. So the Beethoven site, this is what I'm doing with my beats. I'm pairing them with FTM and I'm dropping them here in order to earn this APR and hopefully I'll get a good return on my beats. All right, well that is going to do it for this video tutorial on what you could do with your beats tokens in order to earn some passive income and to leverage and reinvest those here on the Beethoven site. As always, best of luck to you out there. Happy staking. And as always, I hope to see you in the next video.